LGBTQ plus flash news. Sue Bird and Megan Rapinoe share a kiss after U.S. basketball Olympic gold. Megan Rapinoe and Sue Bird just sealed the probable end of their Olympic careers with a kiss. Bird won her fifth straight gold medal on Sunday with the U.S. women's basketball team, which defeated Japan 90 to 75 to extend its overall Olympic gold streak to seven. She got a sweet congratulations from fiance Rapinoe. Rapinoe, the 36-year-old U.S. soccer star, has collected a bronze and a gold in her summer games career, in addition to two World Cup titles. The four-time WNBA champion Bird, 40, has more Olympic gold medals than any American basketball player. She said this will be her last Olympics. Wait, we're still talking about the Olympics? Sports. More sports. Yes. <laughs> I, I love Rapinoe so much. She's always standing up for so many important social justice causes, and this makes me, and this is just her having her fun and her life, and this is beautiful to watch. I hope the homophobic bigots are really mad that a lesbian has more gold medals than any <laughs> other American. I mean, queers just stay winning. Yeah. Stay winning. Uh, you know what's funny about this, beyond the, the two girls doing it, when I saw the picture over the weekend, which is beautiful, um, uh, images and mm. representation matters, yeah. I thought about Will and Grace in 1999. Remember them at the Today Show where they kissed and how iconic <laughs> that was? That began to change everything. This is the first openly girl kiss ever shown live on the television. Oh, yeah, it was Jack and at Will. The Olympics. Olympics. Mm -hmm. that's, it took only 20 years to get there for the girls. Well, and that's why I'm not an Olympian, because it would have just not been a kiss. <laughs> I would have raped her right there with her medal in her hand. LGBTQ plus news is vital for our community and for the broader world as a whole. We have enough enemies at Fox News. Tucker, Sean, and Lara are loud. We need passionate allies. Happening Out Television Network, Queer News Tonight, and It's Happening Out are literally out of the closet and into the headlines. Our community needs your support. Like this broadcast and subscribe now to ensure the growth of the entire LGBTQ plus community.